And hello, hello, hello to all our lovely subscribers, viewers, fellow collectors, and enthusiasts. And welcome to another edition of the Idiot's Guide to Identifying Iron Cross Second Class. And in this episode, we have the Iron Cross Second Class by Ritz Hausch, who also goes by the PKZ number 127. And as usual, thank you very much for all those who have subscribed and all those who continue to watch like and share please continue to do so so we can continue making these lovely lovely reference videos for you guys and for this episode as mentioned earlier we have the iron cross second class by moritz house one of the features of this cross is that its beads are very very well defined or very well established in fact it is so well defined that even in this picture you can clearly make out the beads as being quite sharp. There's only one feature for me that helps me identify a 127 cross, and that is its number three on the dates. As you can clearly see, and being highlighted here on this video, the dates of 127 is quite unique in its shape. It has a long tip, and slightly curling nose on the three. The long tip would be the part that the left arrow is showing or pointing to, and the slightly curling nose on the three is the one that is being shown by the right arrow, which is coming from the bottom on the right side of your screen. So this number three is very, very unique to this maker. And you can find this in the obverse or front, and you can also find it on the reverse. Same features, long tip at the top of the three and a slightly curling nose on the three as shown by those arrows. And there you have the front or reverse and the rear or reverse of a 127 iron cross second class as you can clearly see when these two parts are side by side the very very well defined threes of this maker another interesting note is that none of his crosses were ever marked you will not find or perhaps you are yet to find a 127 that is marked but as of now and as of this video there are no 127 Iron Cross second class that are known to be marked. All right, there you go. Maurice Hausch, PKZ 127. And thank you so much, ladies and gents, boys and girls, subscribers, watchers, and fellow collectors. Thank you for spending your time with me and allowing me to share a little knowledge that I have based on the crosses that I have. And, uh, if you have any suggestions, throw me a message. Yeah, we'll work towards answering them as quickly as possible. But please don't forget to subscribe, like, and share as we continue to help grow the hobby. Once again, this is Chris Kreutz thanking everyone for your support, and we will see you in the next one. Have a good one. Bye.